I did. The puppy's name is Zoe, and the owner tells me back on Friday he was walking her right across from where we're standing over on that sidewalk on Phillips Street when she began chewing something. He didn't know initially what it was. Moments later, she collapsed. <laughs> this was one routine walk, well, until it wasn't. We got about as far as that tree, and there was an empty pack of cigarettes in it, and she picked it up and, and put it in her mouth. Peter Tebalt grabbed the container, worried that she may swallow foil in it and get sick. She did become ill, but it wasn't the foil. And we probably got as far as the other side of the street where she just collapsed, just completely unresponsive. He called a nearby animal hospital, which had its ER and a veterinarian ready for them. They rushed over. And she's had a history of digestive issues, so I thought maybe it was something she ate. I, no, opioids was the last thing on my mind at that point in time. <laughs> Tebald says the doctor gave Zoe multiple doses of Narcan and told him the dog had ingested some form of fast-acting opioid. On, Peter and his family are thrilled to have Zoe back in good health, but he says his concerns about opioids are now greater than they ever were. The greater community is really the, the bigger concern, you know, the fact that a kid could have picked it up. Now Andover police tell me they were alerted to the incident and sent a couple officers over here on Friday. They did find a cigarette container, but there was nothing inside. Police tell me that they do get calls from time to time here for needles being found discarded in different places, but they say something like this, especially the area where it happened, is very unusual. We're live in Andover tonight. Evan White, Boston 25 News.